I'm Tammy and welcome back to my cooking channel. Today I will show you how to make tapioca cake, bánh phục linh, and I hope you will enjoy the recipe. For the ingredients, you're gonna need tapioca starch, coconut milk, sugar, and pandan leaf. Cut the pandan leaf into one inch chunk. Pour 7 ounces of tapioca starch and pandan chunks into a small pot. Cook on low heat for 7 to 10 minutes and stir often to prevent burning. When the pandan leaves get crispy or crunchy, you can remove the pot from heat. In a saucepan, combine half cup of coconut milk and half cup of sugar, then stir to dissolve. Cook on medium heat until it bubbles. Remove from heat and let it cool. Now back to the tapioca starch. Pour the cooked tapioca starch into a strainer and strain all the clumps and the chunks out. You may divide the tapioca starch and coconut milk up if you want to add color. I divided mine and this is a third of it. So just slowly add the coconut milk mixture into the starch. Then use your hand to mix up until there is no clumps. Be sure that the starch is wet but not sticky into a dough. It still falls apart. You can test it by pressing together and it stays, but falls apart when you touch. Now, let's mold the cake. Coat your mold with cooked starch. Then fill up your molds and press firmly. Make sure you press firmly to mold the cake so it won't fall apart. Then use a knife to scrape off any excess. Flip the mold over with a little pressure and quickly dump it out. When you flip the mold to unmold the cake, if any of them don't come out, tap gently on the back of the mold so it will come out. Don't tap too hard or it will fall apart. This cake is powdery and will melt in your mouth with sweet taste of coconut milk sauce. It's not a fancy dessert, but a unique one. Nowadays, you don't see these cakes as a popular dessert in Vietnam anymore. That's why I learned how to make this cake. And this is how I make the tapioca cake. I hope you like the recipe. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching and I see you in my next video.